Welcome to the Arborist. My name is Peter. In today's video, we're going to talk about tree preservation using hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar. So before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, hit the post notification bell. As always, I appreciate you watching the channel. Thank you for the support, and I hope you enjoy the video. So let's get started. Welcome to today's video on how hydro excavation and ground pit and training radar are essential during construction projects, especially for preserving trees. Hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar are two non-invasive methods that can help preserve trees and ensure their survival during construction projects. So what is hydro excavation? Hydro excavation is a non-destructive excavation method that uses pressurized water and a vacuum system to remove soil and debris. This method is used when traditional excavation methods are not possible or when minimal damage is desired. Hydro excavation is a non-mechanical, general process that is ideal for tree preservation during construction projects. Next, what is ground penetrating radar? Ground penetrating radar is a geophysical method that uses radar pulses to image the subsurface. It can detect buried objects such as tree roots without disturbing the soil. This method can also identify potential hazards such as buried pipes or cables to prevent accidental damage during excavation. Next, let's talk about the importance of tree preservation. Trees are essential to our ecosystem and provide a range of benefits from improving air quality to improving shade and wildlife habitat. They also add value to properties and enhance the overall aesthetic of an area. During construction projects, trees can often be at risk of damage or removal which can have significant environmental, social, and economic impacts. By preserving trees during construction projects, we can maintain the ecological balance of the surrounding environment and ensure that the trees continue to provide their benefits. Next, let's talk about the problem with traditional excavation methods. Traditional excavation methods, such as digging or using heavy machinery, can cause significant damage to trees and their roots. The roots of trees can extend far beyond the tree canopy, and traditional excavation methods can easily damage or remove them. This can cause stress to the tree, leading to decline or even death. Traditional excavation methods are also often too disruptive and can cause significant damage to the surrounding environment. Next, let's talk about how hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar can help tree preservation. Hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar can be used in combination to preserve trees during construction projects. Ground penetrating radar can be used to identify the location of tree roots, while hydro excavation can be used to remove soil and debris around the roots without damaging them. This method is precise, gentle, and non-invasive, making it an ideal method for tree preservation during construction projects. Next, let's talk about the benefits of hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar in regards to tree preservation. First, the benefits of using hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar for tree preservation during construction projects are numerous. By preserving trees, we can maintain the ecological balance of the surrounding environment and ensure that trees continue to provide their benefits. Hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar are also environmentally friendly and non-destructive methods that minimize the impact of construction projects on the surrounding environment. So wrapping it up guys, hydro excavation and ground penetrating radar are essential methods for preserving trees during construction projects. And by using these non-invasive methods, we can minimize the impact of construction projects on trees and ensure their survival. Trees are essential to our ecosystem, and it is our responsibility to preserve them. You'll notice here where the trench was dug via hydro excavation, there are no tree roots. So we got a little bit deeper into the trench, as you can see right here. There are no roots. The tree would not be structurally impacted by the construction project, so all is well. 
Thank you again for watching. Here are two videos that YouTube thinks you should watch right now. Take care.